Good day, good day, royal fans. Today's news. Royal watchers normally catch a glimpse of the Queen reuniting with senior members of her family over the Christmas period at Sandringham. However, due to COVID, the monarch enjoyed festivities at Windsor Castle for the second year in a row instead. Now, fans of the monarchy might not have to wait long for a reunion for the royal family, as it's been confirmed a Commonwealth Day service will take place at Westminster Abbey on March 14th. A tweet was shared by the Commonwealth's official account this week and revealed there will be both a service at Westminster Abbey and virtual events for 2022's offering. It also noted that there will be particular attention paid to the theme of service owing to Her Majesty celebrating her Platinum Jubilee this year. While Buckingham Palace has yet to confirm whether there will be a royal presence at the service, Members of the royal family, including the Queen, Prince Charles and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, have all attended the annual event in the past. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and the Earl and Countess of Wessex also make appearances at the service. In the past, and were among those present at the service two years ago. In 2020, the Commonwealth Day service was also Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's final royal engagement before they step back from their position as senior working royals. During the ceremony, Sophie Wessex and her husband, Prince Edward, were seated next to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, which promoted speculation the couple were being lined up to take over from the Sussexes, following their royal step down. Last year, the Commonwealth Day service was cancelled for the first time in nearly half a century because of the pandemic. As a result, the royal family appeared on a special BBC programme to mark the occasion instead. Royal fans normally see members of the firm take to the balcony for Troop in the Colour, which marks the monarch's birthday. However, due to COVID, it has taken place on a scaled-down format, often with fewer crowds due to restrictions in recent years. In addition, other events have been postponed, or in the case of events like Buckingham Palace garden parties have been completely cancelled. This year, members of the royal family are expected to visit parts of the UK and the Commonwealth to mark the Queen's historic reign. That's it for today guys. Please do like, comment and subscribe for more royal content. Goodbye for now.